Okay, what's up guys? So in today's video, as the title says, we're gonna be reviewing the new 400Z. Yes, um, normally on my channel, it's either I work on my 240 or I do like uh, photo editing and stuff like that or cinematography work. So those are like three contents that I normally but I wanted to change it up a little bit today because you know everyone's talking about it I want to get to know more about it and I want to learn and get to know what this hype is all about but yeah let's get right in okay so I I'm on YouTube now and I'm going to search for the video, promotion video for the 400Z. So we're gonna go to the 400Z, we're just gonna search it up, 400Z, and we're just gonna look at the official video. Nissan Next from A to Z. Oh, this is uploaded by Nissan, all right. This is what we need to watch then. Okay. Well, I just want to let you guys know that I have not seen this video yet. Um, I've seen like a glimpse of it all over TikTok or uh, Instagram or whatever, but I've actually never watched the whole entire thing. And um, I'm really excited to see what exactly is 400Z is about. Um, and after that, we're gonna research like the specs of the car, like you know what's good about it, um, whatnot, comparing it, uh, and giving you guys my own opinion. And uh, yeah, so that's how it's gonna be. But before we gonna get right into this, if you guys have a drink, open your drink. Oh, okay, kind of dripped on me. Cheers to you guys. All right, well, let's get right in. Let's let's watch this thing. Wait, that's it? Oh, wait, wait, wait. Let's watch this one. Introducing the Nissan Z Proto. Let's watch this one. Ooh. Okay. Okay, okay.
that was pretty cool like it was pretty epic um i think that it comes with all the features of like the z you know what i mean um like for example like i mean obviously it's a freaking z so i mean why would it be looking like a z but what i'm trying to say is like you know the past z's they didn't really look similar to like the older style if that makes sense like s30 z's so that those are 240 z's um it i love the 240 z's and the way it looks and i kind of dig like that they were bringing back that whole like vintage vibe if that makes sense it looks nothing vintage but i mean i really like the tail light especially i mean i do have mixed feeling on it but i also think that it's kind of cool um because it has like the little resemblance from like older gens like i think especially from 300 zx um not a big fan of those tail lights but i mean you know nissan kind of tried um <laughs> So that's cool, right? Um, okay, well enough. Like you guys might have your own opinions on this. Um, um, yeah, so we're just gonna research like the 400Z specs. Like, what are the specs of 400ZX? Let's see. Um, let's scroll down and try to see what it's all about. It says that Nissan Z Proto is a lightly disguised. Um, concept car preview of okay yeah I know that uh, a twin turbo twin turbo what a fucking twin turbo v6 oh my goodness I just got a goosebump oh wow that's crazy okay I see you to six-speed manual transmission. Okay. And that's good because like I feel like most of the sports car now is like not manual anymore. Like for example like GTR or Supra, you know what I mean? Like there isn't much sports car or high-end sports car that has a manual transmission. So that's really impressive or I, I would say that's really cool that uh, new Z will come out with the v6 twin turbo manual um, that's really cool um, it's likely be in production in 2021 okay that's cool and it will be it's gonna be forty thousand dollar range wow I mean that's really cool I mean it's not as expensive as I expected. I mean, what are like the forty thousand dollar car you can buy? I know, like, okay, so STI, Subaru STI. How much? STI Limited is forty one thousand dollar. So I mean, it's easily a car where it is competitive to the STI. Um, but I mean, if if I had a choice between getting an SDI and a Z, I probably would buy the Z, just because it comes with a V6 twin turbo. I don't know exactly how much horsepower it's making. I mean, you guys know SDI makes about 300 horsepower, but I mean, how many horsepower does 400 Z has? Okay, so Z is gonna have a 400 horsepower. Well, at least that's what they're expecting and yeah i mean that's pretty f cool you know i mean it's a z and it has v6 twin turbo and uh real wheel drive six speed manual and 400 horsepower that's basically like you have a pretty f pretty fun car coming out of the lot um i personally never drove a 400 horsepower car but i've drove like 350 at most not 350d but 350 horsepower at most and i had a pretty good time like in it 
So I mean, imagine having ho 400 horsepower, um, and it's it looks cool. I mean, yeah, like that would be really really cool. You know what I mean? Okay. Well, um, I think that that's basically what you know sums up about the 400Z. Um, but let's look at like aftermarket parts. How's the aftermarket parts is gonna look like? I really love like how Nissan, you know, um, came out with like a new car. I'm a huge fan of Nissan, of course, you guys know that. And I'm also not really a fan of new cars, but this car has potentials because it's like if you want to daily a car that is fast and that is cool and you know it's fun on the freeway it's fun to drive in the city and it seems like this car looks good as it is um i mean there's always so much you can do to it but i mean it looks nice as it is in my opinion i really like the stock body line um yeah i mean it's really cool to see um this new hype about the 400z and i guess i can learn more about this car but i think like you guys can probably do your own research but yeah um let me know what you guys think comment down below because this is super cool um and it might just be like the dopest car in the late uh in the early 2020s because i mean there hasn't been like a very i don't know current controversial with car production um so yeah this is this has potential and this car is literally you know being created based off of what we as a car enthusiast like to have in a car and i think you know v6 twin turbo that sounds like a really good motor to me but comment down below let me know what you think of this 400d but yeah thank you guys so much for coming and joining with me to get to learn more about this nissan 400z um i honestly didn't know what to expect what kind of car it is and i think it's really really cool what they're creating and i hope to see something like this next year and yeah i mean that would be really cool to see it in person um but yeah comment down below what you guys think what what do you think of this 400z and it's all these new features that this car offers that no other brands can able to do it um comment down below let me know what you guys think but yeah um basically this is it for today's video um thank you guys so much for watching please follow all my social media give it a thumbs up if you like this video subscribe my channel and hit that bell icon and that's it peace out